walkthrough, playthrough, review, anything like that. It's just me playing the game badly so you can see what it looks like. Right then, this is Cataclysm by the Fourth Dimension on the uh, Acorn Archimedes, uh, the A3010 in this case. This is a novel game, um, something that I had never heard of before playing it. I have had a little go just to find out what the controls are and it is a puzzle game. You use the keyboard to control it. You've got this little guy here, kind of reminiscent of the guy in Jetpack, who you fly around. It's a puzzle game basically. Um, you've got water coming in through various pipes around the screen and you've got to direct it by, you can leave little uh, blocks like that and absorb them again and stuff. You've got to direct the water to go down into this thing here. Um, you can go up through those and when you go through them they disappear, interestingly. Um, yeah. And if you just, oh, well I'll show you. This won't give me a great score but you'll see what I mean. You, you, you let that through and by default it'll all just pour away like that which is not what you want so you can yeah you can do that there and then it'll all go into the tank where you want it of course I've lost most of it now and it's all poured away and made a god awful mess somewhere and you get points for how much water you save in my case very little there um, right, so I'm going to put a block there. I'm also going to put one there. I like how you can kind of stand under it and block the flow of water. It's a really cool water effect. Ah, yeah, I can go through that. And I like how some of the blocks are water soluble, like I can't break those pink blocks but the water can, so I don't know what they're made of. Um, but they're good. Yes. It's, the, the water effect is brilliant, I really like it. It's And it's very acornish. it reminds me, hello, where's that water coming from over there? It's like we've got more coming in from somewhere. Mm. Yeah, it reminds me of some of the effects that ca uh, I there. God, can I? make words happen not much all right yes um on uh, on one of my acorn electron games there was a, a interesting oh dear interesting particle effect this reminds me of that um 62 that is appallingly rubbish uh quite embarrassing i don't know how many i, I don't get what this does not a clue um But let's. Well, I see. Yes, all right. So one, two, three, four, and uh, yeah, you just count your way along through the different screens. Fine. We'll have another go at that one, just because I am familiar with the layout of it. a bit better than last time if I'm lucky to say a word because it's just all too difficult. We get through there. Ah, ah, no, 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 no. Losing some. Losing lots, actually. 
Alright, let's build up the sides here. Can I? No. Okay, fine. It's all too late. I could really have done with uh, something there like that. All the water's gone through, I think. Ah, there's still... It's interesting, I do wonder if it... I mean, that, as you can see, there's water coming in again. I wonder, when it goes out the bottom, does it work its way back up to the top or something? I don't know. Some kind of funky pumping system or something, because it's coming in here. Ah, OK. I need to get through to the other side because it's filling up round there. Interesting. I've wasted an amount of time. Oh, look at that. I could have scored more, but didn't because I wasn't paying attention. Muppet. All right. Oh. Okay. This is a different one. All right. Um. Hmm. Probably didn't want to do that. Bugger. Oh. Uh. All right. So it can't go through there. Oh. Um. Damn. That work? No. Well, that's just all very unfortunate, isn't it? And I don't think I'll have enough... Uh, will I? Oops. Have I got enough? Yes, I have. Oh, God. And I've got to work my way all the way around there. And that there is never going to go anywhere. Sod it. It's brain taxing stuff, which means I'm not going to get very far, because that's not my forte at all, but I am thoroughly enjoying it. Let's go and see how much of that I'm going to lose. I, oh my goodness. Uh oh. Okay, that may have worked. Oh, and it's all going to flood over the sides now, isn't it? Uh, find the keys. I can't make any more blocks. Damn it. Oh, well, it's not flooding over anyway, so that's all right. Yeah, this is good. I like this a lot. It is it is brain taxing stuff, which isn't good for people <laughs> who don't think quickly. And really, I I mean I'm I'm quite a clever person, but I don't actually think quickly. So when stuff like this is going on, I just get into a complete mess and like duh, brain turns into a big pile of sludge. But it's fun. It's good. It's 
I don't know what I could compare it to. I suppose, actually, I mean, though it's completely different, I think if you like games like Boulder Dash or Repton, you would like this. It's like... I mean, it actually, it's got a very similar feel to Repton. It's like Repton with water instead of boulders. Yeah, I do like it. Oh, and I forgot what it's called. Cataclysm by Fourth Dimension on the Acorn Archimedes. Highly recommended if you've got a brain. And maybe even if you haven't, though you might struggle turning your computer on. Never mind. Mm. Thank you for watching.